Hello, this is Dr. McFarland, and today I want to show you a very cool way to organize your session, especially if you're dealing with a high track count and you need a way to route all your tracks to one centralized area. So basically, I have made a template to where I have all these buses set up and they are color coded. Um, so it's fairly easy to see. And more than likely, I will keep the same uh, colors for the tracks itself. So let's say I had, you know, four guitar tracks and a bass track and some keys or even strings. I can make all those tracks yellow. And then I knew that, hey, the yellow tracks get sent to the yellow buses. Basically, the yellow is going to be sent to the instruments. That way it stays separate from the drums. And then from there, the instrument and the drums get sent to the band bus. And that can be compressed and EQ'd um, all together. And then the vocals and background vocals are separate. So I can always have control over the band, the overall band instruments, and then the vocals and background vocals. And then from there, um, the band and vocal get sent to a sub mix. And that just allows me to have one last stage of processing or overall level uh, balancing before I go into the master bus, which is going to be right here. And my effects chain on the master bus um, is really kind of generic at this moment. Um, I do have a custom preset just for some uh, some slight EQ, um, some some high end some low end and uh, two different places in the mid range and there's also two really cool uh free plugins that you could download from Klangheim. i think that's how you say it uh the dc 1a2 is a two knob compressor uh it's got a lot of different features on here it's really easy to use i pretty much just downloaded it last night and uh, you know, when used sparingly, it can sound really good. And then the MJUC Jr., especially a two-knob compressor just like the other one, um, you got a little bit of control over the, uh, the attack speed. And then this is a JS plugin uh, that comes with Reaper. And it's just called the Soft Clipper and the Limiter. And I am pretty much have it set to where it's... Uh, point negative one at the output brick wall and then if i need to bring up any volume i got 9 db of boost right here and i'll go over my metering system here in another video but for now i just wanted to show you my custom tracks that i have set up here on my different buses um, i got a drum verb an instrument verb and a vocal verb as well as a long delay and a short delay Definitely be sure to subscribe to my channel uh, for more cool tricks and tips in the studio. Subscribe down below and be sure to click on the bell icon so you get notified every time I release new content. And always, always check the description in my videos. I have a lot of cool links uh, to my website and some other um, affiliate links down there to Amazon and whatnot. And I appreciate it if you check those out. Keep rocking. See ya.